Hello ladies, welcome back to another video here. My name is Jamila and welcome to the Joy of Co-Making. Hope you guys are all having a great Saturday. Happy Sabbath. So I'm at one of my local Target, you guys. Just picking up a few things for the house and I'll show you guys in a bit what I got. I'm kind of surprised because a lot of stuff right now has been locked up in this store and I have not been in this Target for a minute. Like a lot of stuff, deodorant, shaving cream, toothpaste, laundry soap. So we know you know, because of the times we're living in, there's a lot of theft and businesses cannot afford to keep having all their things stolen. We see businesses are closing all over around the USA. Some targets in particular too that I saw, but anywho, God is good. I'm just blessed that I could just be here eating, being able to even shop. So God provides and yes, he cares for us and he supplies all of our needs. So stay in prayer. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So we needed mouthwash and I was looking for the best price. So I got four of these fresh mint scopes. These are the one liters, these are uh, $4.99. And I'm always looking for a deal, right? So I got two of these medium Colgate toothbrushes, usually $5.99, so they took a dollar off. So they're $4.99 in a pack, $4.99. Okay, so yeah, I'm just browsing too because I need to get a few things. I need some new laundry soap and I'm actually gonna be switching over to um, Tide. But I needed some of these um, stainless steel scrubbers. These are by Scotch Bright. These are $2.79 a piece. So I got two. This is just under $20. Uh, this is the 94 load Tide. Um, yeah, so that's the one that I have because I have different um, scents and different types of cleansers. I wanted to do the Tide with Downy, but I went ahead with this one. Um, it's heavy duty. So. You know, I'm gonna go back over here and show you guys what they have. Is it me or the laundry soap containers? Why do they look smaller? I don't know, should I do the pods, you guys? Or the laundry soap? I don't know. I've never tried these pods before. Hmm. You get 45 packs, that's all you get? No. 85 packs. You don't have to measure anything though, so that's a plus. You don't have to pour anything. I wanted to get like an older eliminating one because they have one like for um, with Febreze. Okay, I had to turn the camera around. So they have this Febreze one, but I just don't know about the scent because I'm kind of sensitive and my kids too are as well to certain scents. So I don't know if should I do the pods or the liquid. You know, I just stick with the liquid for now. But they have the free and clear, which I do not want to do. But there's all types of um, Tide, right? So what do you guys think is the best one? I almost wanted to get the Oxy, the Ultra Oxy one. And they have an Ultra Oxy with older eliminator. That's a 94 low. Hmm. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. What is the best Tide that you guys use? And I know it depends on the scent factor too. I do like downy. I wasn't sure about the sport, how the um, smell of that one was. They got this Febreze here, spring and renewal, or spring, yeah, spring and renewal. I wasn't sure about that. And then I was like, is this a good soap here? This is Paracel Original. Have you guys ever used this soap before? They even have like the pods, the original Tide. But anywho, I needed to come back because I felt like I, did I get the biggest one? 94 loads, 94. Yeah, I think I did, you guys. I think 94 is the biggest size, okay? I just wanted to double check. I don't know, like the container seems so small. I feel like I need to double check. Yeah, this is the 94. Why does it look so small, y'all? <laughs> it looks bigger in the case to me, like in the case where they're locked up. I was using, um, what do you call it? The Arm & Hammer for a long, long time. But I think I wanna switch over to Tide because Tide is pretty good. And then they have this Tide Simply with Oxy. How much is this? Wait, it's only 10.49? No, it's cheaper. Wait, 128 loads for 10.49. I felt like I should do that one. Maybe I should get two of those because the one that I have there is 20 bucks. Okay, ladies, so I got two of these instead, okay? These are the 89 loads, um, 10.49, that's a good price. So I need to save some coins right now. Good deal. 
I'm curious to see if they have the Hamilton juicer because I was like really trying to find a juicer that works for me and I didn't even realize I returned the juicer that I had. I think I changed my mind about it. But yeah, so I'm in a market for the Hamilton Beach juicer. Seen it on Amazon, but I just want to see what they had up in here. I don't really have anything in here at the moment. Low stock. Maybe I'll just go online and check. But I like the Hamilton Beach wide mouth juicer. Quite empty over here. This is a really nice Dutch oven, 7.5. It's by a brand called Figment. Is this a new brand? Hmm. But I love that blue color. That is really cute. Must be a new brand here. It's a little empty throughout, but it's called Figment. Have you guys heard of this brand? Looks pretty cute. I like the colors. The quality looks okay. <laughs> Very nice. These are some nice mixing bowls. These are stainless steel, okay. Cute. Figment. Prices look good too. Very empty, right? This is pretty cool, you guys. I've seen this for years. What do you guys think about this? So this is a permanent filtered coffee maker and it's only $20 by this brand here. And that's actually not bad of a deal because who wants to keep buying filters? Looks like there's a stainless steel filter. Such a good idea, right? and it holds eight cups of coffee, something like that. Okay, ladies, so I'm headed to check out. I think that's all I'm gonna get for now. I really do need to do some little tidying up in my cabinets all through the house and do like an inventory check and just see yeah, where I'm at with a lot of things around the house. And yeah, I'm gonna be going to Ralph's Market in a bit after I leave here. Gotta do some grocery shopping. So God bless you guys. Have a happy Sabbath, bye. Thank you.